Hi, if you have a problem with getting too much spam or fake inquiries from your web forms and your lead generation forms, here's a method that can help you eliminate the spam and filter out the real quality inquiries. What I'd like to show you is how you can connect Google Recapture to lead gen app forms and uh, to basically have the Recapture pop up show up before the submission of the form to ensure less of these fake inquiries come through. So, how do you do this? In your Legion app account, we have a um, dedicated recapture section here. If you go here, you can add a new recapture key. That's the first step. So you go here on add new recapture. You would then have to provide this, this bit of information. And for that, we will have to go to Google directly, Google recapture, go to developers.google.com forward slash recapture. And then here go on get started. Here you see some bit of information uh, on the different types of recapture that are supported. Google had different versions, starting with recapture version one, which is no longer in use, and version two and version three are the ones at this moment which are available. So let's go here to version three to set this one up. And it gives us this um, info guide here, and then it says register your keys here. Now let's go through the setup. We'll have to add our domain. So in this case, we're going to go with our label first. So let's let's just call it um, new recapture key. And we want to go with the version three type, and we'll have to add our domain. So for this case, we're going to add this form is meant for the Legion app domain. You're going to simply type it like this without the HTTPS. And that's the correct format. Owners, I'm going to just put my own email here for now. Accept terms and terms of service. And you can optionally choose alerts to owners. If you put yourself as the owner email, it says get alerts if Google detects problems with your site. So um, this may be useful. I turn it off for now and uh, go on submit. So now we get the pieces of information that we need, the site key and the secret key. So we're going to copy the site key, go back to lead gen, put it here, and the same thing here with the secret key. And let's give it a title, new recapture. Setup. Okay, and then you go on save. It has been added. On the Google site, you are done with everything. So you can go to settings where you see your configuration. I mean, this this should be fine for now. Save it. Um, and then you can obviously log in any time with your Google account into this dashboard and see what um, the analytics are and what amount of requests have been blocked. So to finish up our setup in lead gen, we got our key here now. There's not much more you have to do in here. Now you'd have to go to your form where you want to have the recapture show up. So we go to forms. I want to set it up for this one here, web design agency inquiry form, and then go to form settings. And then here you have Google invisible recapture. Recapture is enabled. And then I'll just simply pick the one that we've just configured. So if you can set up multiple of those in the recapture section right here, uh, for now we just have this one and then just save it. So let's try this uh, straight away here. So this is the form, it's just two simple steps, service requirement and uh, name, email, phone number, send message. So it takes a little longer and that was the recapture working right there. You may have seen it here at the bottom of the screen on the right. I'll show you one more time. So this was the invisible invisible recapture that we support in Legion Forms, which is even less intrusive for the user. Um, there's no, uh, let's say, um, challenge or no score to fill in, to go through. So um, this is um, the type of check that has been done. So just see right here, if we go and send message, you see the protected by recapture. Okay, in this case, it did pop up uh, a, a challenge, possibly because we have done it twice. But normally we support the invisible recapture, which you've seen in the first inquiry where um, it straight away went through. Um, yeah, this may happen if you have, let's say, 
a, um, a user submitting multiple requests or straight after each other to as an extra bit of information. And here you see this one will work as well. So that's how you can configure recapture and legion forms. It's easy to do. Uh, just find the right uh, link from from Google that that I've shown you here before. Um, go through the simple setup with your Google account and configure it in Legion app. So that's it for now. There's other things you can do for um, preventing form spam that we'll show you in some other videos. So stay tuned and see you soon.